वेलकम गाइस शिवम हियर टुडे वीडियो इज अ एक्सपेरिमेंटल वीडियो इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू रिमूव स्क्रैचेस फ्रॉम माय ओल्ड फोन दिस फोन हैज अ लॉट ऑफ स्क्रैचेस एंड इट इज गिविंग द प्रॉब्लम इन विजिबिलिटी एज वेल एज फॉर द टच रिस्पॉन्स समटाइम इट ऑल्सो हैज घोस्ट टच प्रॉब्लम ड्यू टू दोज स्क्रैचेस सो आई एल रिमूव द स्क्रैचेस विद हेल्प ऑफ सैंड पेपर दिस इज अ फिफ्टीन हंड्रेड ग्रेड 3m sand paper and after that i'll polish it with cerium oxide powder i'll make a paste of it and then i'll apply it on the phone's screen you can buy these products from amazon as well as from any automobile shop for amazon i'll provide its link in my description box below but if you are using this means if you are removing the scratches with the uh, sand paper and cerium oxide then be careful it is not a official way actually there is no official way to remove the scratches it is a simple experiment so i won't be responsible for any cause of damage first let's start with the sand paper you can see there are many scratches on this mobile phone and i have already tried cerium oxide on this area i don't know uh, you are able to see or not i request you to please watch this video at 1080 pixel see on this area all scratches are got removed same we will apply cerium oxide on whole screen and if there are deep scratches on your phone like this see these are the deep scratches then you will need a 1500 grid sand paper see this is a 3m 1500 grid sand paper you can buy it from any automobile shop or you can also buy it from amazon i'll provide link for 1500 grid sand paper and cerium oxide in the description box below first of all i'll sand this deep scratched area with the help of 1500 grid 3m sand paper for that make sure your sand paper must be wet and take small amount of water on on the screen make sure water should not enter in your smartphone from this edges or fingerprint sensor or button or earpiece make sure you are sanding in the circular way don't sand vertically or horizontally sand in circular way i'll hold my mobile vertically so that water can't enter into the edges see sand paper is removing the scratches i have uploaded a similar video on my youtube channel in that video i have used asus zenfone 2 laser it has gorilla glass 4 but many viewers asked me to test this method on samsung phones See, almost all deep scratches got removed. Now see the difference between this area and this area. I have sanded this area with the help of 1500 grid sand paper, and this area is pending right now. Now I am done with sanding the entire screen. Now you can see all major scratches are gone, but there are still hairline scratches. For that I am going to use cerium oxide. It will remove all the minor scratches. First of all, take cerium oxide powder in the bowl and mix it with water and make a paste. Then apply it on the screen. For rubbing purpose, I have made this small and simple buffer. If you don't have it, then you can simply use a cloth, a soft cloth and rub it in the circular way. In my case, I have this small buffer. I'll simply power it up. This will remove all the minor scratches. Don't let it dry. 
I'm not applying this powder on the edges because later it will cause a problem and will stuck into the edges. Now I have polished entire screen, you can see the screen is pretty much clear now and the next step is apply the paste and let it be dry. And then after simply polish it with a soft cloth. Take care of edges. It should not stuck in the ear piece. So I am leaving that area. Same thing is applicable on this button area. This is also a fingerprint sensor. If powder stuck in those edges, then it will be difficult to remove it. Now see, it is partially dried. Now I'll just wipe it in this circular way. Same as we did with the sandpaper. We'll remove it with the help of soft cloth. Now our polishing process is completed. Now see how clean screen is looking. All scratches are gone and now mobile is looking brand new. You can also apply oleophobic coating if you want. You can purchase it from the Amazon. If you want then I'll provide link in the description box below. I hope you like this video and I'm seeing it again. It was an experiment so if you have a confidence then only do it. I won't be responsible for any cause of damage. But you can consider this video for knowledge purpose. If you like this video then don't forget to do like, share and subscribe and also press that bell icon. Thank you.